Hey, you guys, welcome back to the Mountain Morning Show. We are in the kitchen with Stacy Springer. <laughs> And it's Einstein's Kitchen. Today we are learning one of my most favorite things. Okay, when I went back to the, the prep area, our kitchen, I was like, yes, we are talking about fruit today. I am so thrilled about this because I, I cannot tell you, this is a weird summer for me. This is like all I'm eating is the fruit. fruit. I don't know if it's because I'm like dehydrated or just I'm especially drawn to it this last month, but I am so happy you you did yes. what I'm exactly what I was going for today. Welcome well, back. Thank you. And you know, like a woman who's learned how to voice her opinions, you have said to me, will you teach me how to do <laughs> fruit and I listen. She has delivered. I can't read your mind but I can I, can I know to you, you. Gotta, you just gotta tell, tell people what so you yeah. need and I'll give it to you. There you go. Yes. Before we go any further, <laughs> before we go any further, can we get a close-up of Stacy's hair. <laughs> okay, so if you noticed, she has like a, a, gr a green glow going on, and we can't go any further before you tell us what okay. happened. So there's a little bit of prep that goes into the morning. Oh, for sure. Me. I sure. drive up from the Ogden area, I get my hair done, and uh, this morning we stopped by the grocery store to get our stuff, and then I was like, I need a little bit of hairspray to just spray in the car sure. as it moves. Like the little compact Yeah, this ones. little thing, yeah. and I was looking in the grocery store kind of in the reflection window, and I just sprayed it, and I was like, great. And then I looked at my hands in the car and it was green and I'm like <laughs> oh shoot what is this green <laughs> and then my amazing assistant Lisa just started laughing hysterically because she said well your hair is green oh, because we shoot. bought green hairspray because uh. it was the like travel size oh sure yeah and why do they have a travel size green hairspray why not I have no idea why this even yes. exists but okay it does in so case you need to know I figured once she got done laughing it was good because we were doing watermelon and I was green life green. imitating art yes, yes yes and it was good and it's like the show must go on <laughs> So we're here with I, green hair. I was like, it's most so women good. would have started crying, yeah, no. probably. And I was like, I am. You get like extra ten points for dealing yes, with that. Like, ten points. It, it, it just, it's just part of you now. It's just, I it can't imagine you without it. Me. Okay, so anyway, so anyway the green hair. Is, moving on to some good, fruit. On. That's right. So what, what, are, what exactly so are we learning? We're gonna talk a little bit because fruit is confusing to some people on how to choose. It can it. be. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So um, with lemons, uh, I'm gonna tell you how to do it. Okay. So. Can you fill these two, like weight-wise? <laughs> You're like, I'm filling them. <laughs> weight-wise is one heavier than the this other. This one feels heavier. Cool. Am so I right? that means this one is more juicy, has more juice in it. Who knew that? Right? Did, it, did you guys know that? Pretty I have no cool, idea. Huh? So okay. there's one way. Um, you know, any like an orange would be the same. Okay. I was trying to get two that were different, and they sure, weren't. Sure, sure. You can always. So you know check how that I way. judge my oranges? I see. Is this squishy enough? And that's so I can useful. peel it. But have that's you ever gotten a big it. one because you think, oh, that's going to be juicy because it's uh, big, and then you open it and it's like kind of dry. dry, and it, the pith is I like really hate thick. That. I know. So now, maybe you'll know, and you'll just be in there doing this, mm -hmm. and it looks amazing. It's okay, so with fruit. peaches, yay. Smell. If mm. it smells like a peach, mm. it it's must be ripe. a peach. It's also a peach. It must and be a it's ripe. Ooh, I like that. That's a good one. Yeah. Is this off a tree? I mean, yes. <laughs> I'm going to go with off? Yes. <laughs> No, what I mean is that is this from your a tree of a uh, friend? It is what from, am I trying to say? From you know, my Harmon's friend. Uh, yes. Okay, from your Harmon's friend. It, it, ju it, it just looks yes. pretty. It looks pretty, great, doesn't it? Uh, I'm stop talking. I love you. I have green hair. It's cool. Yeah, it's okay. cool. <laughs> I'm like, is this from so, a real? Is this a real peach? This is the another thing with this mm. is that obviously you look at the color and look how beautiful it looks. But can you smell it? Does it smell like a strawberry to you? It does. Good. Okay, because all I could smell was my lotion. <laughs> but it's also <laughs> the same one. thing with that. Is that it should smell that way? And if it's it's if you, green. If you don't, and that's a yeah. pretty logical thing, but you don't realize that. Right? So if yeah. you see people sniffing fruit, it's totally okay. Although the, <laughs> these ones were $5 for the, you know, the carton of them. Sure. And the other ones that were not as ripe were $1.50. Mmm. So. They know something They there. do. Okay. So with grapes, I don't know if we can see here, but see how this one's a little bit more brown? Oh, so the stem. stem. Yeah. I don't know if we can. That means that it, it lasted longer on the vine. Right? So. Oh. And that's nice because what, yeah. is it, what, what does that mean if it was able to last longer on the that vine? It's more ripe. Because they do ripe. pull things earlier yeah. in the season. It's and a little then, brown going on there. That, mm -hmm. That's a good thing. That's a good thing. Okay. These, these ones are obviously more green, but. I'm sure you know, they're still tasty. I'm sure. <laughs> we should taste them and check. <laughs> but those so are just good. a few things to notice. I now, have no idea. The watermelon. Where should that, I put these? You, yeah. Um, or there. Yes, I will put them back here. Okay. It's good to have a plan. It is good. It's called mise en place, right? <laughs> what? Okay, it's French. It oh, means okay. everything in its place. It's very chefy. Ooh, Ooh, that is chefy. Okay, so grab a watermelon for me. This okay. smaller one, unless you've been lifting. Oh, okay, we'll do this one. Okay, so this is the test of 
Okay, you look at it, does it have any big um, spots that are yellow? That means it was shaded more. So this is, obviously there's gonna be a spot that looks like it's been sitting on it, mm -hmm. and that's fine. Mm -hmm. But you want it to be in the sun to be ripe, and then you kind of thump it. And if it sounds really hollow, then like a drum, I know it's kind of hard to tell, but ch check a few and see if they sound different. Then you know that, that it's it's so full. That's of a good hollow sound. Juicy, sure. We'll see. Juicy. <laughs> it's juicy. We'll find out. It's yeah. juicy. Okay. Cool. Yeah. So I don't smell this one. You can smell it, but <laughs> yes, you can smell the cantaloupe. But I can't smell the it's fruit. Part, right. The cantaloupe, the cantaloupe is a tricky one. I love cantaloupe. Smell that. And one. I've been like, that's a good one. Yeah. That's there a good you go. One. It smells. Someone told me like at the fruit. store. That has something to do with this too. Is with that the, untrue? What, I don't know. With the touching or with Someone what told you me <laughs> you throw it <laughs> like spaghetti. <laughs> no, something like sticks. that. And then then you know. It's I don't know. You could do a lot of different. People do different weird things at the grocery store. I know. I know. And it's really like, fun to watch them. What are you doing to that actually. fruit? <laughs> anyway, so I'm going to show you how to cut this. Okay. okay. So you were asking me. This is this is what I want to know. This yes. is why. We're doing this today. This is why. This the is cantaloupe. Okay, I have a lot of knives here. I don't need all these knives. I'll move some of this one, okay? Um, we're going to get us a flat spot, okay? That's that's always the goal with okay. something round. That's, that's good. Okay. This, and then uh. I am going to cut down the sides here because we're just going to make cubes. If you want it in your, um, in your slices, you can do that, but I just like to do bite-sized ones. Me too. I figured well, that, that's why. That's a lot easier because the way I do it, um, I would cut it in half. Yes. Cut those into the little, the little wedges. 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 And yeah. I would um, then slide it along the bottom. Yes. And then I would cut that. <laughs> then I would. It was a process. Yes. This is much easier. This is easier. Well, it depends. It depends on how you want it. That's yes. kind of you want to plan before you do it. So. That's true. It's you know takes a little bit of work. I am losing a little bit more than I probably want to, but I'm she's, trying to do it kind of fast. She's doing TV time. I'm doing TV That's time, right. yeah. So, I honor you, cantaloupe. I honor you? <laughs> Get all the, the green bits off. Yeah. So, oh, I can smell here's that. Smell good. It I've never seen a cantaloupe this. like that, because I've really? always, no it's one, naked. I guess no one cuts them the right way. Okay. <laughs> Except right. you. So at this point, you're like, well, what do I do with this? So what? you can do slices. So what I do, you can either do it down the middle. Let's do it down the middle. Okay. And so you have this part, right? Yes. Spoon, please. Spoon. Spoon me. Spoon you. Scalpel. Okay. Okay. And I do know how to do this part. I'm just scooping out the insides. Yep. Just yep. a spoon. Simple. And then you don't, because you don't want to eat all those seeds. They're not going to hurt you, but okay. So that's how you do that. All right. And you get two halves. That's the best thing about it. You get two. <laughs> this is one of those one things where I'm like, I ate the whole thing, and you feel <laughs> great about it because I do that. I'll buy cantaloupe and eat half eat of the it whole for, thing for breakfast. So I'm going to do some slices here. Okay. It sticks to your knife, which is good and bad. Thank you. Mm -hmm. All right. So it depends on how big you want them. I find that people make their slices too big, and then it's hard to eat it. Mm -hmm. I'm like, I don't really want to cut my fruit all the time, right? Mm -hmm. So you can do it like this. Stay together. And then just do slices like this. I need the long knife. That's why we brought it. Right? Yep. And then. That was so much quicker than how I have done that. Yeah. So, That's amazing. Ta-da. And this is why you have many knives, and I, why I can be okay can with I having so many knives. Yes, We're you must taste. taste. Okay. Mmm. That's so good. But I also made this basket, so we can put it in there. Oh, that's what that's Isn't that for. fun? That's really fun. She was like, Chelsea, do you want to cut one of these? And I was like, You were like, yeah. I'll think about it. <laughs> I so, will see. Do you want to try the watermelon in that method? Although you're not going to have the middle to section out. Yes. Do you want me to try this? Yeah, I'll try it. Yeah, okay. we'll try this. Okay. Um, Let me get out of your way. Okay, same method. Okay. Same method. Okay, so do, so do this. Uh -huh. Okay, so we got that. Good job. Thank you. You're welcome. Step one <laughs> is over. 
my pieces. Are, this is gonna take forever. It's, it's a little bit thicker, so <laughs> don't don't be afraid of seeing red. Don't worry, guys. I won't keep you here the whole show because I think we have like one minute left. Like the wind. Okay. Actually, we do have one minute left. Is there awesome. anything else we need to know while yes. I'm cutting this? Yes. Okay. So I have a date night coming up this Friday. Yes. Woohoo! And we're gonna do fresh pasta and um, steak There's and shrimp. And Chelsea is going to be I'm there. I'm going to be there, guys. I'm going to be there. I'm bringing my husband. Neither of us know how to cook, and she's going to teach us how to it's do gonna it. It's going to be so awesome. So yep. I have one spot left, one Ooh. couple that could come. So if you're interested, um, you can contact me, ekbites.com. Very cool. And you're, you're not going to want to miss it. It's what are we making? Good time. We're going to make pasta and three different kinds of sauces. Did you already scratch. say that? I did, but we can do it again. <laughs> <laughs> I am so concentrated on this right now, you guys. This is this is a big deal for me. Okay, well, thank you so much for You're joining welcome. us here today. I'm so glad I know how to cut my freaking cantaloupe now. That has saved me so much time. I'm so glad. I know how to smell my peaches, too, which is really good to yes, know. And they come from <laughs> a tree. so weird. Okay, well, thank you okay. once thank again. You. And uh, we're going to be here right back here tomorrow morning from 7 until 11. Check out more from Stacey Springer. She can teach you everything you need to know about working in the kitchen. And I do believe we're going to wrap up about right now. Are we wrapping up right now? Yeah, okay, we are. All right. Well, thank you, Stacey. Thank nice you. to have you here with us thank today. You. We'll be right back here tomorrow morning. Have an excellent day, you guys. We'll see you later. Have a good one. Should I